Hey everyone, uh, welcome back to Cosmo Not Mostly in Workers and Resources Soviet Republic. Right, okay, so I've wound time forward just a little bit since the last episode. I got all of the uh, building constructions over here sorted out, and uh, that, um, that means this episode we can go about uh, setting up the, uh, the planning for uh, the next uh, growing season. Uh, getting the mechanisms and everything, and uh, assigning them out and all of that. So we've got 11 um, large fields here, uh, which I think the uh, this one farm can actually uh, operate. It can definitely do six of them, uh, but I think it can do... It can do all 11 of these and maybe a couple of small ones over here or something like that. So, so there's that. Uh, th so that's going to be the major planning, uh, getting all the fuel up here and all of that jazz. Uh, you get all that sorted out. That's going to be the, the major work. Before I get started, however, I want to uh, just take a, a, a look in here. Uh, we're down to 11.7 million owed. And we've got a million in the bank, uh, roughly. Um, and that's down uh, 800K from when I started the construction projects just running, uh, from when I started winding time forward. So in 1,550 days, uh, if we don't pay anything early, the Republic will be debt-free. Yeah, I know. It's uh, pretty big. Uh, now, I just want to just uh, check in on here. So, last month, we uh, exported 880k worth uh, of uh, goods and services, and we uh, imported 168k, 168k worth. And that has um, left a pretty substantial net of 714k, roughly. Now, if we go back over here, you can see our monthly uh, payable on the debt is only a quarter million. So uh, we're, we're actually well-placed now. I'm pretty sure that uh, unless I borrow a bunch of stuff I don't need, uh, we're not going to be in too big of a, a problem. There is, however, something that may prove interesting, and that is uh, the mechanisms here uh, in the... Uh, I'm looking at dollars mechanisms. So there's a harvester with speed 30 over here, and there's a and the tractors are all uh, up to 27, right? But here we've got so that's that was rubles, but here we've got a harvester that's speed 35. Right? So we kind of want that western harvester, right? And we're going to need like half a dozen or so of them. And that's uh that's 12k dollars each. So we've got what one two three four five six seven we got 30 slots for uh, mechanisms here so uh we want a tractor and a harvester uh for uh for both for for each field basically uh and that means that i could theoretically support 15 fields off this farm right and uh that's kind of the direction I'm going with this, actually. Uh, but 15 times uh, 13 is a number. Uh, so, you know, 150, it's 200K, right? Uh, roughly. Uh, so we can actually do that. Um, properly, I should, uh, I should order it from the uh, the NATO border and all of that jazz, right? Properly. But I'm not going to. 
Um, if we uh, bring the map up, if we bring the map up, yep. Yeah. Oh, come on. So if we bring the map up, we're here in the middle. And to get to the NATO border, we have to go a fair bit up this way. And that's going to, that would take quite a, now we do have a road connection. So we could potentially do it, have a depot up here and drive the, the, the machinery down. Which is what I should do if I'm going to do Cosmonaut on this. But I'm not going to do that. And the reason I'm not going to do that is it's tediously boring. Uh, uh, and uh, I, I want to have everything in place for, and of course, we've got the fuel stops and everything we'd have to have along the way. So uh, it's uh, it's something, I'm just not, I'm just not going to do it, right? And that, uh, that means, uh, well, uh, yeah, it is just Cosmonaut mostly after all. Uh, anyway, uh, so I'm just going to buy it directly uh, in the, uh, in the uh, farm. Uh, now, to do that, I'm going to have to go in here and go in here. And I'm going to need to borrow about 300k and we'll borrow it for five years. And let's make it 400k ish. Let's make it 500 and even 500. So if I borrow the dollars, right? Okay, so that's going to tick down, right? Uh, we can sort that out. Don't don't worry. Um, uh, building is without power supply. Hmm. Uh, right. Okay. Well, let's uh, let's get time ticking, and then I'm going to buy the mechanisms. Uh, so we're going to buy <clears throat> one, two, three, four, five, six. Um, okay, so four, eight, twelve. Yeah, okay. And then we're going to go in here. No, we're going to go in here. And we're going to go under, under sewing, and we'll get the fastest one. Okay, so we've got a bunch of those in there, right? And we don't need trucks. We don't need trucks, okay? Uh, right. The trucks are going to go in these. Okay, uh, here first, however, we're going to need some, uh, we're going to need some power up here. Yeah, we're going to need some power up here. Uh, okay. Well, in that case, uh, we'll go with uh, electricity, medium voltage switch which will stick right here. Yep. And I should be able to just put a mud road. Railway crossing too close. Okay. Um, get rid of that. Okay. Where is it? Oh, it's over here. Medium voltage switch. Uh, put it back about here. Yeah, okay. And then we can go ahead and try that mud road thing again. Oh, I can do this, I think. Oh, hey, yeah, that would be autosave. Yeah, we'll do that. Yeah. A mud road along the, the rail line is perfectly reasonable. Okay. Yeah. 
Oh, I can do that too. Oh, nice. I'm good with that. Okay. We have a mud road. Um, right. Okay. So now I need power wires. Okay. Um, cancel wires. Cancel those. Yeah. Okay. And then we want wires that go up like that. And like, no, uh, like that. Okay. Now, uh, build those. And then we're going to go in here and assign that, that, and that. Okay, good. Now we're going to need a power substation over here. Uh, which we can put right here. Or do we, yeah, or do we want to put it up here? No, we want to put it here. Uh, okay, and then we'll uh, mud road that onto there. Yep. Uh, make sure that gets built. Now we need wires. Um, okay, so we can come up to here, then across like this, uh, cancel a bit there, yeah, and like that, yeah, yeah, okay, build it. Now assign it. Uh, good, it's assigned, and that's assigned, okay, good. So that will get built. Good. Now, where do we have our fuel supply? Um, that's bitumen. Our fuel supply is over here, isn't it? Actually, our fuel supply is down here, but we're bringing it up. Oh, you know what I should do? Do I have a small oil tank uh, mod uh, uh, storage? Uh, green. Small oil storage. I do have a small uh, oil tank. Um, yeah. Small oil tank. I'll put that up here. Uh, I can... Ooh, I can fit it in here. Or I could just fit it in here. Uh, yeah, I could just fit it in here. Yeah. Bam. Okay. Uh, this one I'll gravel in. Okay. Just like that. Yeah. Uh, okay. So, that's going to be uh, a storage. Now, how much does this take for fuel? 45. 20. Yeah. 20, 20, yeah, that's a perfect size. Okay, now, uh, let's, uh, let's get time ticking here, because this stuff needs to get built, right? And, uh, oh, right, yeah, okay, now here, I'm going to need a couple of uh, oil tankers. Uh oil tank um, capacity that's probably bigger than we need but you know what put three of those in there eh? yeah okay 
And then we're going to do um, we're going to do a drop off here, here, and here. Yeah. At destination buildings, we're going to fill them to seventy percent. Yeah. Um. Okay. Good. I just need something to fill this guy up. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah, I just need something to fill that guy up. Uh, but meanwhile, this uh, road is getting constructed. This stuff is probably all getting constructed. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we got a mechanism there, so that's good. Um, now, uh, we have a, we have two, four, six, eight. 11. Uh, so I only need to set one of these guys up with uh, with operations. So we're going to have a destination here. Unload if it's f until it's full. Don't load at the silo. Right. And then we're going to Building needs road connection. Duh. Of course it does. Um, okay. One. Two. Three. Four. Okay. Good. Okay. So that gets us... Um, all the fields are, uh, are set up. In there okay that means we're gonna need covered trucks right uh, so uh, it's covered hull uh, total capacity uh, 12 tons of crops in there yeah right so we'll put a dozen of those in there um, I'm going to set this guy up with them as well. Uh, covered hull. Total capacity. Good. I'm also going to set the destination building. Uh, still going to be an unload to 100%. Yep. Okay. Good. Uh, we are building rail here, so there is that. It's uh, it's doing some stuff. Um, I need to uh, set up uh, some more um, uh, tasks here. that will set up some more tasks. Okay. Um, right now. Um, so I've got the trucks, those. Oh, I need to build the tank. Yep. Now I have a fuel distributor over here, which I can use this guy, right? Yeah. I can use this guy to distribute fuel over into uh, here. Yeah. Okay, that will definitely uh, work. So I'll, I'll keep that guy open. Uh, we'll close that stuff out. Look at this. Um, hey, we just need gravel and uh, workers. And then, oh yeah, that's going to build pretty quickly. That's good. Uh, yeah. Okay. Right. Okay, so we have stuff, uh, stuff ticking along here. Now, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with the crops initially. I might just export them, uh, until I build the, uh, the, the processing that I'm going to do with them. 
Now, I haven't decided if I'm going to make alcohol, if I'm going to make food, or if I'm going to make meat. Um, so let's um, let's go take a look in here. Uh, no, it's no, it's here. Imports. So meat is costing us eight k, and food is costing us twenty twenty some k. Oh, we want last month. Meat was twenty two k. Uh, food was 56k and clothes is uh, 71k right so uh, we're going to need crops for any number of things right and uh, meat uh, like food and uh, food and uh, meat are probably going to be the big things that we that we need to make right so uh, that, that'll be the, uh, the thing to explore for, for the next episode. So my goal is to get, be basically self-sufficient except for clothes and electronics. Uh, and then maybe call it a, a season or something and, uh, or, or whatever. I'm not sure. Um, but anyway, uh, and maybe call it there and then see, see about retrofitting sewers and water and everything and see if that can work. Uh, I'm not sure how well that'll work, uh, not with the dense operation I've built here. So, so it'll take a little bit of uh, finagling, right? Uh, anyway, uh, right. Now, if we, if we go back in here and if we take a look here, now we're down to 11 and a half million owed. Uh, and that, uh, that's making some some progress even as we uh, fiddle around there's two years left on the on one loan and then three to four on the uh, remaining ones right uh, and that's uh, that that will that will get paid off as whoops as uh, as time uh, goes on don't mind me I was just killing a bug an actual uh, biological bug. Um, right. Uh, okay. Um, right. So, so all of that is that. Is that. Um, okay, we're down to, uh, we just about have our uh, storage built. Yep. Once th okay, that's built. Good. We're going to store fuel. Okay, just so we don't mess it up. Uh, we're gonna name this the uh, uh, S Z I G E B acute O V acute A R. Uh, agricultural fuel supplier operations. Yeah. Okay. Good. Okay. Now, if we go in here and we go and we add here. Yep. Okay. That should send some trucks to start filling that up. Uh, then we go in here and we add here as a pickup. That'll pick up fuel only. Yep. Okay. Good. Right. So that should be fueling everything up. Uh, now in here. We have, uh, we don't want this guy to auto search, but we've picked up all of the fields that, uh, uh, that, uh, yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. No, we didn't pick them all up. Okay. Uh, so if we go bam, bam, that's all of them. Okay, good. Uh, so it will, it should plant those next, uh, 
next sewing season, right? Uh, now, while I'm fiddling around, we're going to go in here. Can we fit a medium field in here? We can fit a medium field in here. We can fit a medium field in there. Okay. No. Okay. So if we fit a medium field in here. Uh, a truncated medium field, but a medium field nonetheless. So I can put one of those in there. And a small one in here. Yeah. A small one in here down here right okay now uh, I'll need a road that comes down like this and then like this and then like that yeah and then like that right yeah we can get we can uh, get behind that idea uh, okay yep might as well stick a couple fields in there um, okay so that will get built um, close that yep now we go ahead uh, if we grab a construction office we can look at the uh, at the uh, progress we have an unfinished road uh -huh. Oh, okay, so the power situation got itself sorted out. Right, okay. That's good. Uh, we're up to 880k again in the bank. This will tick along and uh, we can uh, take a couple more loans over time to uh, keep this ticking. Um, I have a trick uh, for uh, turning rubles into dollars. Uh, if that turns out to be uh, the uh, most sensible thing we can do. Uh, I'll just show you what that is, actually. So we would go up to the NATO border, right? So we got the NATO border here. Uh, no. No. Oh. Oh, maybe the other NATO border, the other uh, shared border down here. Okay. So, so we have a power source here, right? And then down here, we have a power source here. So we put an 18 megawatt power line between those two spots, right? And then we import the max for rubles, and then we out, we export the max for dollars. Or we reverse that if we have dollars to turn into rubles. So I would need like the, constr the helicopter construction operation. Uh, I build the uh, power line and then uh, from there, it would be possible to uh, to build the uh, uh, to, to build up uh, dollars. Now it would be quite a lot simpler to extend the rail line all the way up to here. And I think maybe it might be worth roughing that in. Uh, this one has rail, right? Yeah, it does. Okay. So we'd come down here. Right. Run this straight up and out, right? Why don't I rough that in? Uh, with um, that. Get those. And, you know, basically we just run it up the uh, grid line like this
Oh, that's that's too long, huh? So we run it length, 2,900 meters. Okay. And then we go up some more. Three kilometers is the maximum segment length, huh? Okay. And we come up to about here. Yeah. Uh, and then we come up here. And we can come down about this far and turn snapping back on about this far, like this, and about this far, like that. Yeah. Okay, so we come down like this. And we do this. We need a double track bit here. And we should be able to run this across like kind of like this, kind of like that. Kind of like this, and kind of like that. Yeah, okay. Yep. So we'll bring this down to about here. No, actually, I'll double track the whole thing. Uh, so we come to here. Okay. Okay, so we do that. No. Bring this down. Why can't that cross? Okay. Okay. Bring this down. Okay. And way down all the way to the connection point. Yeah, so that is the, um, that is the NATO export uh, line. Uh, and this is where I put a waiting yard for the uh, thing there, right? Now, I'm not going to start construction on that because that will be something that can be done in the idle time when I'm not building more railroads. And, um, yeah. Okay. So here... Um, we're not actually filling that up. Why aren't we? Um, okay, so the fuel distributors. Oh, it's set to load from there, didn't it? Yeah. Okay, that will um, that will fix that. Uh, okay. Or it should. Okay. Yeah, we have fuel in there. Um, okay. We don't have anything coming here. Why? Fuel. 
Yeah. Fuel. Fuel. Ah. Trying to load oil from here. Well, that was definitely not going to um, to work. Where are you? Yep. Okay. Right, and I can take one more truck from here. Um... Actually, no. I can take one more truck from here. Buy a oil tank. Yep. Total capacity. Eh, we'll grab that guy. And you can go... Here to here and this will wait until unloaded for fuel and this will load fuel yep and then we'll go view line we'll put a name on it um, Okay, so we'll just call it something. Save it and start it. Okay. Because we want our uh, trucks here to have fuel, right? Uh, and they're not going to unless something actually uh, allows them to. Okay, so now we need to build these two bits of road. Good. We are filling the thing up with fuel here. This is good. Yep, that is definitely good. Yeah, okay, so uh, everybody is going to have a, a nice uh, fuel supply when uh, spring comes around. Um, yep, there we go. We are okay. We are now going to have a full fuel supply for that distribution office. There we go. Yeah, good. Um, okay, uh, so far, so good. Now Okay, we're uh, we're building the uh, the last bits of gravel roads here, and then I'll assign the fields, and then we'll have the basic uh, crop growing operation underway, and yeah, that'll be a uh, that'll be progress, definite progress. Okay, so we go in here and we assign that field. Yep. And then... Okay, off we go. We're, we just need to wait for that road to finish building.
just about. There. Okay. That has got... That's got everything operating there. Okay, good. Um, yeah. Okay, definitely good. We're at 1.2 million up here. Um, yeah. So what I'm going to do just before we go is I'm going to go in here. I'm going to pick the furthest out one. And pay it off. Yep. So now we're down to 10.3 million owed. Uh, next time around, it will drop under 10 million and it'll just keep going down. This is going to keep ticking. Um, the dollars is going to keep ticking. But that's fine. Uh, it can keep ticking uh, as much as it wants. It's going to go 8K a month. Uh, we've got a little while before that's going to be an issue. Uh, and I can stack up a few more loans there before it'll be difficult to pay off. And we do want to get some dollars coming in at some point anyway. And that's just so that uh, we can buy blueprints and stuff later, as, as I understand it. So, yeah. Anyway. Uh, that's gonna be the uh, that's gonna be all for for this this episode. Uh, so, yeah, uh, that's um, that's everything for this episode. So I'll just mention that I have a Patreon if you want to support the channel. It's an option. I don't feel obligated. Uh, the links in the doobly doo if you want to, and yeah, if you don't, again, no big deal. Uh, it's just there in case you you ever want to. Uh, aside from that, uh, that's pretty much everything. So uh, see you back next time.